Well, hi. Good day to you. How are you doing? I can't actually believe I'm making this video and saying this stuff and saying it out loud. Um, me and my friend here, I've got some news this morning about this channel. Um, let's just dive in. So, as you know, this month, which is June 2021, I've been on YouTube for 10 years. And during that period of time, it's gone through a whole host of rejigs and things. And I think like all of you, I've been looking for some answers sometimes. What are the answers and what, what direction should this channel be taking? Because as always, the travel stuff is really popular. And I've reached out and asked you guys, what do you want? Shall we stop motivation on Monday? And the comments that I got about that were insane. And I am so grateful for all of you that said, no, we really like your Mondays. They really make us feel energized for the week. And even, you know, some of them were real personal. Um, I don't know. I just felt really blessed that you were saying some stuff. Now, I've done lots of research on YouTube, what makes it work, algorithms. I've been on a course with Tim Schmoyer. I don't know if you know him. He's from the Video Creators, and it was incredible. And it was all about building what you want to build. Now, the thing with YouTube, there's either two things. And I'll give you a little story. So, um, with their new ha house and our new doors and everything, one of the handles got really stiff and ended up one day there was a bit of an accident and Nathan got stuck in his room and we was trying to get him out because he had to go to work and Jasmine went straight on YouTube how to like it wasn't picking a lock but you know that sort of thing how to open the door and we found what we wanted and we left that channel again to never see anything again from that person we don't know what their name was all we know is they gave us the answer so that's education so it can come under education or it can come under entertainment and my channel more comes under entertainment but the travel comes under education and that's a little bit complex so what where i'm going with this channel is i'm going to go deep i'm going to open up really open up i have got so many life stories to share with you i'm not 20 years old anymore I've been through some stuff and I've got some answers to some things or some ways of dealing with things. And I think a lot of the time that's why you come here because you want an answer to something. And if I can help with that, I'd love to. I'd absolutely love to do that. Now, it's going to mean, of course, I've got to be very vulnerable and open up to letting you into some really personal stuff. And obviously, I'm going to have a limit. There's certain things that I won't be sharing. Um, but I am quite an open person and there's a lot that I will be sharing. So a little example, like you might not know this about me, um, but I had, well, in fact, there's a, oh my God, am I going to actually say this? Something that I call my anniversary day, which is the 4th of June. And it's a day when I consider that I became a bit of a warrior in life, a, a survivor, if you like, because a couple of things happened on that day. I don't know if I want to tell you, actually, because it's a bit of a book spoiler. But there's a couple of big things that happened and um, and it's going to be in the book. It's going to be in a couple of books, actually. One that I'm writing now and one that's, well, I'm writing both of them now. But one's the IVF one. Anyway, so June the 4th is my Became a Warrior Day. And I do like to big myself up about that. And I like to treat myself on that day. And I went through a lot of infertility. You probably know that. But what you might not know is I had endometriosis and... Um, a lot of ladies out there, and I know a lot of you are girls, and a lot of you are guys. There's about 50-50 split on this channel. So there's going to be certain things. I'm not going to insult your intelligence in saying, like, oh, you've got to choose, you know, what, what. But I'm going to just go deep into that story and what I did about it, and any tips and tricks and advice, as well as just taking you on my travelling kind of life and my journey um, because it's going to be, there's going to be funny bits, there's going to be sad bits, there's going to be ups and downs, and I like that on YouTube. I don't know what you like, but that's what I like. Um, so I've had a few video suggestions, and I have written all those down. One of them was, what channels do you like to watch? And generally, the ones that I like to watch are where you get to know somebody. You know, we're all a little bit nosy, we all like a little bit of a fly-on-the-wall documentary. But getting to know somebody, I've definitely got something in my eye. It's probably... My, Harley, mind the pampas grass, my darling. See that even that blessing. He's, we've got so much to tell you about Harley, and that's I'm going to film that video next in a minute if I've got time before I leave for work. I think I have. Um, look, 
So I've got news about him, which is a little bit tugging on the heartstrings. Um, and I've got some massive news to tell you in the next video, um, which will be coming up the, the, the day after you've watched this one. Me still sitting here, but just another video. And um, so I am going to go deeper than I've ever been on this channel in the hopes that you guys are going to get some inspiration and some motivation from it. I did recently go through a bit of a journey in my mind of thinking, do I open up to clients again more than I am now and take on a few more people because I'm so passionate about helping. But I think if I do that, it's going to deter me from this bigger platform, which is YouTube and blogging and writing the books and stuff like that. I want to be able to get um, so I just saw a shadow at the other side of the door, but I think it's the wind blowing the blinds. Um, I want to get you guys, as many of you, influenced as possible. And as always, leave me comments in the description, in the comments down there, because you'll see me about there. I will be there and I'll be talking to you guys and, and answering you and helping in whichever way I can. I'm not saying that like I've got all the answers to everything because I don't. You know, I'm a real person with real valid feelings and difficulties and struggles, the same as you, but I've overcome a lot of things and I want to encourage you to do the same. And that's where this channel is heading on this approach to my 10 year anniversary. So I'm gonna be doing a bit more vlogging. You'll be pleased to know, because I know loads of you like that. Some of that will be the people that just come to get their information and then they move on. So if they want to go to the Gran Serenis Riviera Maya in Mexico, they'll come and look at my information. I've given about food and drink, for example, and then they'll go again. They don't really care about me, my life, being motivated by me. They want an answer to something. But those of you who do also want to be part of the whole living the lusher life thing, you're going to see that too. You're going to have that opportunity. So I hope that's making some sense. But like I say, I've done a lot of studying around it. And I just thought, let's sit here in the mornings with my coffee and do some more of this. I do like a coffee in the mornings, don't you? I froth it up with one of those frothers that you get from Amazon. Best thing ever. It makes it taste different. I don't know how, but it just does. Mm. And I notice whenever I edit back, and I normally edit out me slurping my coffee, I do this licking lip thing. That you, you don't get to see that in yourself normally, do you? Really weird. So this little snoring fella, I've got some news to tell you about him. So make sure you've subscribed to this channel. You probably have if you're watching this far in. But this channel is going to go deep at the expense of my vulnerability and a little bit frightening. But I'm going to do it. Feel the fear and do it anyway. So um, I just want to help somebody who was somebody like I was the person that I was on that anniversary day June the 4th the year 1999 gosh that was a long time ago now you know that person I was then I've learned so much and come so far and I thought I was pretty strong and awesome then but I've done I've come I've overcome a lot of adversity and if I can help one person believe in themselves and think you know what, if she can do it, so can I, then that's that's exactly my point. Now, just a little quick side note, this morning I've had some news from the people who are my distributors for my book to say that we've sold another load of books in the US this month and it's only like the third today, it's mad. And these are people, I don't know who they are, but they're coming and they're buying my books. And that is a reaffirmation for me that that's what I need to be doing is sharing those stories. So book two, which is called Deja Vu from Behind the Mask, is being edited now. Final edits that will be released within the next month or two. That's exciting. There's another one. I'll tell you about that in the next, not the next. Yeah, maybe the next video. Yeah, the next video. Um, which is to do with Harley as well. But there's a book alongside that that I'm writing at the moment. And I'm writing with pen and paper, which I love. I'm so much more creative and it's just flowing so much better than it does on the keyboard. And it means I get to keep slightly longer fingernails. Um, so there's a lot happening. There's a lot going on. And I hope that you guys are on board with that. If you are, support my channel with a subscribe and a, and a thumbs up. And hit the notifications bell so you can see when I've um, uploaded. I don't often ask things like that. I don't often ask for things like, like a lot of people sort of have got GoFundMe pages and stuff like that to support their YouTube because the advertising has been pulled quite a lot since COVID times and um, understandably so. 
because companies are struggling. I get that. I'm not going to do that. So if you can support me with your numbers just by clicking subscribe, that would be awesome. So I don't know what I'm going to title this video up yet. I've thought about it and thought about it and it will come as I publish it. But hopefully it's clear. Hopefully it makes sense. So see you in the next video, which is probably going to be slightly tear joking, talking about Harley um, and and a journey that's taken me on that you guys are going to be part of as well. So take care and I will see you then. Bye for now.